In this second part of the video, we'll look at wireframing and creating quick, interactive prototypes for user experience testing. If you haven't seen part one, go and have a look at how to build wireframes using Pencil Project. Okay, so here we are in Pencil with all the wireframes. We've got the activity screen and uh, we've got the button that goes to uh, contact details and the button, the next button that should then go to the summary screen. And we've got two buttons here, change and next, and the next should go to the confirmation screen. And in the confirmation screen, we have another button. So let's go back to the first button, uh, the big button. We'll right click on it and we can see that there's a thing here that says link to. And we can choose what we want to link it to, which relates to all of these different pages. So we can link it to the activity screen. And that's it. We go to the activity screen. We've only got one button here. I right click on it. I can go link to. Now I want this button to go to the contact details page. I'll go to the contact details page, to the next button, right click on it, link to, and I want this one to go to the summary page. And the summary page, I've now got two buttons. So the change, the change I want to actually link to, I want to go back to the activity screen so I can change everything. And the next button, I want it to go to the confirmation page. So here we go, confirmation page. And then the final page, I've got three buttons. I've got the PDF, I've got the exit button, um, the only one I actually want to work is the uh, another sign up and I want that one to take us right back to the start screen. And that's it. It's as simple as that. So now I can save it and I can now export this. OK, so this is the way when you export it, you're actually exporting it uh, as an interactive prototype. Uh, so in the export screen here, we've got different things that we can export it as graphics or PDFs. But what I want to do is export it as a single web page. So I click on single web page and hit export. Um, and that should, here we go, it should then export it um, as a web page. And now I've finished with pencil, I can actually open that web page up in my web browser. Right, so now I'm in my web browser and I've opened up that single web page and you can see that it's essentially just one page with all of the different screens as images, uh, one on top of the other. And if I mouse over these buttons, you'll notice that my, my mouse pointer turns from the pointer to the hand arrow. Uh, now I'm just gonna um, zoom out so that it actually fits in. Okay, now if I click on these buttons, you can see that they literally uh, move from one image to another. So this has the effect of looking like I'm actually going through the screens. Uh, even though these are just static images, um, we can now use this as a way of actually running through. So I'm, I'm going next, I'm checking the details, I'm looking at it, I'm going next, I get to my confirmation screen, um, and then another sign up. I can click on that, it takes me back to the sign up page, sign me up, click on that, I can click next, next. Not the sign up. I can go through, I can check on change, it goes and lets me click through. So you can see that essentially uh, this is my working prototype. Um, I can now use this um, either to print it out or I can actually share the actual web page with people to actually test. So here we go. Um, this is the finished prototype using wireframes using Pencil Project.